Hey guys, so today I'm going to be testing out a lot of high-end makeup from my Sephora VIB haul. Um, needless to say, I'm extremely happy with everything and how it turned out. Just take a look. It speaks for itself. But anyways, if you're really excited to watch this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe for future content. Hit the bell so you're notified when I upload. And all these products will be linked down below as well. So make sure you go and check that out. There'll be direct links to Sephora. And yeah, let's just get started. I already have my base on, so I have primer and foundation. I know primer, right? So weird. Um, I wanted to use primer today because I'm using a lot of nice luxe products and I'm actually going to dinner. So I want to look nice. And I'm so excited to try all these products. Um, they are super bougie, so let's just get into it. So I'm going to go in first with the Jouer Essential High Coverage Concealer in the shade Chiffon, and I'm going to put that underneath my eyes. This is what the applicator looks like, if you were wondering. And I'm just going to apply that underneath my eyes. Now that I've applied the product, I'm just going to blend it out with my Shop Miss A little sponge so this is really really full coverage and I love that because my under eye circles are pretty dark but look that is this is so worth the hype oh my god this is so full coverage and it doesn't feel too heavy it does feel a little heavier than my um, Too Faced Born This Way concealer but the coverage is outstanding. I am so in shock. And let's talk about that online shade match though. I added bronzer off camera. Um, if you're wondering what I used, I use the Chanel Tan de Soleil bronzer, um, the cream products because I'm gonna be using cream, so I wanna keep that in the theme, you know what I mean? And then I'm gonna add powder over top, of course. Um, but next, I'm gonna go in with the Hollywood Beauty Light Wand Easy Highlighter from Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I think this is the one that I wanna use right now. Let me see. Oh no, this is in Spotlight. I'm gonna use the blush first. So it's the same thing basically, but in the shade Pink Gasm. And I'll show you what it looks like. And then obviously we're gonna use this one next, but we're gonna go in with the blush first. I absolutely love this. I wanna add a little bit more, just because this color is giving me life. And I saw this on TikTok, so of course I had to buy it, but just how beautiful is this color? I'm like going crazy with this, but I'm so obsessed. I'm gonna add a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with the highlighter in the shade Spotlight and just put that on the high points of my face and just blend it out. Look at how beautiful my skin looks right now. <laughs> Charlotte Tilbury is going to take my money, girl. But anyways, I'm going to add a little bit above the brows because I don't really have that much texture there anymore. And I want to bathe in this because I am obsessed. Next, I'm going to go in with the Hourglass Translucent Setting Powder. Um, I've been so excited to try this. Um, Maddie Bernard, I think her name is. One of the YouTubers raves about this and just look at the luxe packaging. I just can't. So I've been so excited to try this and it seems like it gives you a flawless base and who doesn't want that? So I'm just going to open this up and then, oh that sucks. How am I going to tap it? Okay, I don't like that about it. You can't really like tap it in here. It's gonna get stuck. Okay, anyway, so I'm just gonna pat out the concealer again, just in case there's any creasing. I'm just gonna apply the loose setting powder. Wow. 
Wow. Please tell me I'm not the only one that sees this. My under eyes literally look perfect. And I don't use the word perfect often, but my under eyes look perfect. I really didn't want to like these products so I don't have to purchase them again, but I guess I'm gonna have to because Ridiculous, dude. This is amazing. I, I'm in love with this video already. I have two products left to test out. So next I'm gonna use the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Finish. Um, what is this? Complexion Perfecting Micro Powder. So this is in the shade 2 Medium. And this is what it looks like. It looks really washed out on camera, but it's really not that light. I'm just going to take a nice fluffy brush and just set underneath the bake and everything. Um, I don't want to set that because I'm just going to do that with my regular schmegular products, but I'm in love with this. I'm in love with all of it. And I'm not even being paid to say this. I know you know that I'm not being paid to say this, but tell me my base doesn't look flawless and my skin isn't all that so you know that these products are working I mean I'm in disbelief I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my face makeup lips and eyes and eyebrows whatever and then I'll be back um to try out the setting spray so yeah I'm really excited so there's a little tiny bit of fragrance um, but it smells like clean. It's not really anything major, but hopefully this is what it claims. I've seen so many people swatch things and then it doesn't move. Actually, I want to try that. Let me get an eyeshadow palette and let's test that. Okay, so I'm going to take the KKW palette. This is just what I grabbed first. Let's put this like orange shade. I have one here and one there. And we're going to spray one of them and let that dry. All right, so it's pretty much dry. So, of course, this one is going to budge. And let's see. Okay, that's the part where it's wet. But up here. Oh, my God. Okay, so I'm just going to take this off before I forget. But thank you guys so much for watching. All of these products were a straight 10 out of 10 for me. Every single one was a hit. I'm telling you, they're going straight in my everyday drawer. I just can't believe that these products are so good, I guess. Because of the high price tag, they're really good. Even though there's a lot of drugstore products that are really good, I'm not saying that. But they better be good for that price tag. So, I'm really happy that I enjoyed all of these so I didn't waste any of my money. But you guys need all these products. I'll have them linked all down below. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!